That was an interesting class. Wasn't precisely what I had in mind, but it was still brilliant. But for certain you'd have helped. It did sound like fun. I shouldn't have been so concerned with getting in trouble. I think it's good to take risks every now and again, especially when it comes to potions class. Sharp may seem gruff, but I'd bet a few galleons he blew up a potion or two in his day. Best be off. Next time we talk, I promise, fewer explosions. What are you calling me, Gareth? I was hoping you might want to redeem yourself for not having brought me that Fupa feather and potions. You see, I have an idea for a fizzing Wisby inspired beverage, but I'm missing a key ingredient. You and your concoctions. I don't know how you come up with these things. It's a gift, truly. So, I suspect the key ingredient in fizzing Wisbies is dried billywig stings. I heard there's a store of them in Honeyduke's cellar. I'd get them myself, but my Aunt Matilda has her eye on me. Thinks I need to focus on potions class for a while, not for my own bruise. I was hoping you could follow a secret passage to Honeyduke's cellar and grab a few dried billywig stings for me. Of course. You never know when you might need a quick means of escape from the castle. Brilliant, thank you. But you should know that it's not exactly quick. It's the secret bit that's helpful. The passage is hidden behind the statue of a one-eyed witch in the third floor corridor. Just tap it with your wand and say, Descendium. I'll see what I can do, Gareth. Fair enough. You shall be the first one to taste my newest brew if you can be of help. Perhaps I can convince a meat to help me with my potions homework, get my aunt to loosen her reins a bit. I'll need to get those dried billywig stings for Gareth if he's to finish his latest concoction. A one-eyed witch statue shouldn't be too hard to find. Yes, I told you. You're very clever. Clever. How attentive. Hello, Mr. Moon. Oh, greetings. Uh, any luck removing some more of those demiguy statues? I actually have some moons for you. Oh, I knew I could count on you. Uh, bring me a few more moons, and I'll show you how to improve casting Alahamora. I'll keep an eye out for more demiguy statues and see if I can bring you more moons. You are to be commended for your bravery and valor. Especially since they can only be collected at night. Revelio. Hello, Mr. Moon. Oh, greetings! I'm sorry to... Where should I look for more demiguy statues and moons? All of my usual haunts, which incidentally have now become quite haunting. Here in the castle, in Oxmead, and believe it or not, in some of the surrounding hamlets. 
Oh, my tormentor is nothing if not thorough. Kept me from all my usual engagements for an eternity now. I'll keep an eye out for more... Have you found any more of those ghastly demoguys statues? Goodness, who knew this was all down here? A lift must be how I get down. Looks broken. Revelio. Seems to have done the trick. This castle will never cease to surprise me. have to get past this. Did the trick? This must be the way out. Hmm. I need to find a way to open that gate. Incendio! Something smells sweet. Must be close to honey juice. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Revelia. Honey Dukes. I can smell the chocolate. Now, where would I find the dried billywig stings for Gareth? I have the dried billywig stings. Now, back to Gareth. I can only imagine how his new recipe is going to turn out. New butterflies were attracted to treasure. I must have missed that one in beasts.
What are you up to now? Hello, Gareth. I have those dried bilioic stings. You got them? Incredible. Getting them was more work than I expected. I'd like to be paid for my time. Of course. Didn't think it would be that much trouble, but I'm happy to pay for your help. Thank you again. I'll let you know when I brewed my first batch of fizzing whiz beer.